Since joining the ACC in 2004, Virginia Tech has played in four of the six conference championship games, winning three of them. Last season, thanks to a four-touchdown performance by quarterback Tyrod Taylor, Vitek defeated Florida State 44-33 to take home the crown. This season, the Hokies had to not only replace Taylor, but their backfield of Darren Evans and Ryan Williams. The answer? Sophomore quarterback Logan Thomas and junior running back David Wilson. After easily defeating App State to open the season, the Hokies traveled to Greenville to take on East Carolina. Although Thomas struggled in his second career start under center, the Hokies relied upon their ground game to narrowly beat the Pirates. David Wilson's 138 yards and Josh Ogilvie's go-ahead touchdown in the fourth quarter enabled Vitek to stave off ECU, giving head coach Frank Beamer his 200th career win with the Hokies. Virginia Tech would suffer their only setback of the season on October 1st when they welcomed the undefeated Clemson Tigers to Blacksburg. Behind a dominating defensive performance, Clemson sacked QB Logan Thomas four times and held the Hokies rushing attack to only 133 yards on the ground. The Tigers' 23-3 win also snapped Tech's 12-game win streak in ACC play. Thomas and the Hokies would get back on track in a big way the following week against Miami. After the Hurricanes scored on four consecutive possessions to take a 35-31 lead with 2.51 remaining, Thomas knew what he needed to do. What happened next was an eight-play, 77-yard drive that culminated in this. Logan keeps it up the middle. Ten, five, touchdown, Tech. A tremendous fake by Logan Thomas. Thomas finished the game 23 of 25 for 310 yards and five total touchdowns as Vodtech defeated Miami 38-35. The Hokies entered their October 29th contest against Duke as 15-point favorites. They walked out of Durham with only a four-point win. The Virginia Tech defense came up big when they needed it most. With less than two minutes remaining in the game, Hokies cornerback Chris Hill tipped the fourth down pass by Sean Renfrey, which was intercepted by linebacker Barquell Rivers, allowing Vod Tech to avoid a shocking upset that would have altered the Coastal Division race. Coming off a bye, the Hokies entered Atlanta with a purpose. Since the ACC split into divisions in 05, the winner of the Virginia Tech-Georgia Tech game has played in the ACC title game every year. This season would be no different. Helped by a career best, 175 yards rushing from David Wilson and five total touchdowns by Logan Thomas, the Hokies knocked off the rambling wreck 37-26. Having climbed to fifth in the BCS standings, the Hokies had one final hurdle in order to reach the ACC title game, win the Commonwealth Cup. Behind a stifling defensive performance, Virginia Tech sacked Cavaliers QB Mike Rocco four times, forced four turnovers, and allowed only 30 yards rushed into a Cavs offense that was averaging nearly 178 yards on the ground per game. The 38-0 win over their in-state rival solidified the Hokies' spot in the 2011 ACC Championship for the fifth time in seven years. 